Hello. Welcome. Are you struggling with WPS Office displaying in Chinese? Do you want to change it to English? This video will guide you through a simple process. Let's get started and make your WPS Office experience more user-friendly. First, open WPS Office. Look for the WPS Office icon on your desktop or in your Start menu. Click on the icon to launch the program. Next, identify the WPS Office button. It's usually located in the top left corner of the screen. It often has the WPS Office logo on it. This button is similar to the file button in other office suites. Click on this button. A drop-down menu will appear. Now, navigate to the settings. In the drop-down menu, look for an option that looks like a gear or has Chinese characters that mean settings. The placement may vary slightly depending on your WPS Office version. Click on this settings option. A new window will open, displaying various settings options. Look for the language settings. In the settings window, find the option related to language. It might be labeled with Chinese characters or an icon that looks like a globe or the letters EN. If you see Chinese characters, try to match the visual cues or icons. Once you find the language settings, click on it. A list of available languages will appear. Scroll through the list until you find English. Select English as your preferred language. There might be multiple English options, such as English, United States, or English, United Kingdom. Choose the one that best suits your preferences. After selecting English, click the OK or Apply button. This button is usually at the bottom of the settings window. Clicking it will save your language preference. You might be prompted to restart WPS Office. If you see a message asking you to restart the program, click Yes or OK to restart. Restarting WPS Office is important for the language change to take effect completely. After WPS Office restarts, the interface should now be displayed in English. You can now use WPS Office comfortably in your preferred language. This simple process should resolve your language issue. If you encounter any problems, feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful. If you found it useful, please like and share it with others who might be struggling with the same issue. Consider subscribing to support the channel for more helpful tips and tutorials. Your support helps me create more content like this.